A sea of people flow through Seattle streets as demonstrations continue. Now the protests spread to other countries, signs of a global movement. They call it the Global Day of Action for the Occupy Movement. And here in Seattle, nearly a thousand people have converged onto Westlake Park in downtown Seattle. King 5's Tanya Mosley is live at the park where protesters are set to pinch tits. There's 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 are set to pinch tits. Pitch tents for the night, Tanya. Well, you know, it's illegal to pitch tents here, but folks are still doing it anyway. They are up and doing it right now. They want to put up about 500 tents. There's also something else happening here. If you can see behind me on 4th, folks are in the street in front of Chase Bank. They're protesting Chase Bank. As you said, there were about 1,000 people out here. There are now about 3,000 people, we're told, and everyone here has a story to tell. And the only thing that matters is the dollar. They are here to stake their claim, to have their voices heard, to occupy Seattle. And we're here, and we're upset, and something has to change. Mark and Misha Randall rode the bus from South Seattle. This is their first day. We just kind of had our coffee, looked at the paper, and it's like, yeah, let's, let's go down there. The story the world needs to hear, they say, is the one they've been living. I'm, I'm starting over. I'm 41 years old. I was working for a company that had Washington Mutual as a client. It was a tech company, and when Washington Mutual failed, jobs went away from that company starting, starting immediately. And my job went away within less than five months. I'm uh, 56 years old, <laughs> and I've worked since I was 14. I've already tried uh, Wall Street, you know, with a 401k investments and that tank. Uh, invested in real estate and that tank. And so what's next? Where do you go? And there's just a fundamental unfairness right. to it. You work hard, you do what you're supposed to do to achieve the American dream, and that's completely shifted. And so the Randalls march with the others towards their symbol of greed. The American dream used to be home ownership, and now it's just, can I save my home? The Randalls promise to be back to speak out. It's the only power, they say, they have. And again, back out here live, you can see several things are happening here behind me. Folks are rallying a little ways down. They are putting up those tents. The mayor, again, as I said, said it's illegal. They will arrest folks. And anyone who is here after 10 p.m., he says, will be arrested. Like he's did all week, he has invited them to stay over at City Hall. But for now, the folks say they want 500 tents here tonight, and they're not planning to go anywhere. Avoiding live at Westlake, Tanya Mosley, King 5 News.